What's up peoples, what's up peoples, what's up peoples, it's your boy MM2K back again with another video. Look, here's the thing y'all, um, we hear a lot about, um, why do I want to get Stadia, you know what I'm saying, especially when they got games like Borderlands 3 that is running off an older model, you know what I'm saying, an, an older update version or whatever you want to call it, and I'm here to tell you that Regardless of that older model, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That it's performing better than consoles. Now I've had people try to push back on that online, you know, on social media with no evidence, you know what I'm saying? And then what I'll do is I'll post videos and then they disappear into the stratosphere, okay? Enough with the talk, okay? I'm done with the talking. Come over right now, because right now, I you can either catch me live or you can catch the on-demand footage of me playing Borderlands 3 via Stadia at 60 frames per second. A lot smoother than you can get on the world's most powerful console. You can catch me doing that now over at the official channel for the Stadia dosage platform, okay? The link to that channel was below. And because we're officially in 2020, what I need y'all to do is if y'all want to keep abreast of the Stadia content, that we drop on the regular. I'm gonna need y'all to sub to us over there because we are officially going to launch our Stadia information there as well as follow us at Stadia Dosage on Twitter. But again, enough with the talk. A lot of people wanna follow emotions of others. You know what I'm saying? They have no proof. They're, they're set in their ways. And whenever you disrupt whatever way that they're set in, the first thing to do is to push back, right? whether you have facts or not it's just it's just a human thing i just don't practice that i've learned a long time ago that if you want to grow and excel in the things that you understand and the things that you actually know opposed to what you guess then you have to have an open mind and when someone comes with counterfacts to what you formerly may have known it's worth maybe vetting and kicking the tires and seeing if it's true now if y'all want to be in a place of disbelief or whatever continue to do so it don't matter we got the facts on our side. But if you want to at least argue against cloud gaming from a state of knowledge, then come over and look at my gameplay footage. You know what I'm saying? So at least you're not making false arguments. You know what I'm saying? If Even if you do have an agenda, come one, come all. I don't care because <laughs> we got the facts on our side, baby. And if you're going to make an argument again against cloud gaming or just Stadia because you're an Xbox fan and you, and, and you feel that Phil Spencer may have told you to do so because Phil told you so, come on over. See the gameplay live in action. Get some analysis. And then maybe you can realize, okay, well, I'm not going to talk about the performance, but maybe the pricing is something I'm going to focus on. And we'll get you there too, but it's okay. But again, for those that just want to enjoy it you know what i'm saying as well come on over stadia dosage we are running borderlands 3 live we got footage of it right now you know what i'm saying so you can either catch it live you know what i mean if you hop fast or you can catch it on demand and with that said can't wait to see y'all there let's have a wonderful wonderful gaming day peace